Please welcome your host for our special presentation, Mark Daniel. Thank you very much, everyone. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. And welcome to everyone watching on our Disney Parks blog live stream. As you know, there are a few new things happening in the galaxy. And for everyone here right now, and everyone watching all over the world live on our Disney Parks blog live stream, you are all in for a tremendous surprise. But first, let's talk about why we are here tonight. Who here is excited about Rogue One, a Star Wars story? Wait a minute, guys. I think the force can be stronger than that. I'm gonna ask one more time. Who here is excited about Rogue One, a Star Wars story? Well, all right, everyone. Here's a reminder of why we are so excited. Jim, whatever I do, I do it to protect you. So you understand? I understand. Well, yeah, yeah. Our rebellion is all that remains to push back the Empire. I think he might be able to help us. When was the last time you were in contact with your father? What is this? It appears he is critical to the development of a super weapon. If my father built this thing, we need to find him. All right. How many do we need? They are requesting a call sign. It's, um, Rogue. Rogue One. that we are dealing with here is immeasurable. If the Empire has this kind of power, what chance do we have? We have hope. Rebellions are built on hope. This moment, the force is strong. Make ten men feel like a hundred. We'll take the next chance. And the next. You're rebels, aren't you? Save the rebellion! Save the dream! can't wait but it doesn't stop there folks Walt Disney Parks and Resorts have a few special offerings celebrating the newest installment of the Star Wars franchise and to tell us more about it is Disney Creative Entertainment show director Michael Roddy hey guys may the force be with you may the force be with you we don't know if we should say always or also with you, then it gets, you know. Always. Always. I always. think that's it. Try yes. it again. May the force be with you. Always. Nailed it. Much better. We're live, by the way, Michael. We're live? Yeah, we're live, Michael. People all over the world are watching this. Michael Roddy, you have had your creative hand in everything Star Wars and Disney for the last couple years. So we are excited to find out how guests can interact and experience Rogue One, a Star Wars story in the parks. Well, Mark, if you're excited for Rogue One, and I know I am, this is something that I've been... The first minute that they said Rogue One, oh. and it's the, the story of how the Death Star was built, I was in. I, I'm so excited. The Death Star is one of the most iconic ships or space stations in the entire Star Wars franchise. But what's great at Walt Disney World Resorts, and especially Disney's Hollywood Studios, is that's where we have Star Wars. You can go and have a full day of Star Wars, and I've got some amazing announcements about that. 
very much. All right, well, let's start those announcements. What do you All have right. for us? First off, how many people here have seen Star Wars A Galaxy Far, Far Away? <laughs> so as you know, with that show, we, uh, we recreate some iconic moments from the entire Star Wars saga. Well, starting December 16th, in celebration of Rogue One, A Star Wars Story, we're going to celebrate all eight films. Hey, Mike, Mike, uh, I'm sorry, I don't want to correct you right now, but we are live, and you kind of messed up a little bit because you said seven. I no. mean, you said eight, but I there's did. actually seven. Because there are eight Star Wars films. And starting December 16th, we're going to have some new characters appear in Star Wars A Galaxy Far, Far Away. And I'm talking about the Advanced Weapons Resource Troopers. Look at those guys. Are they not cool? And they're scary. If you think stormtroopers are uh, the elite of the Star Wars Imperial Army, these guys times 100. Wow. They're awesome. This is good. All right. Now, uh, let's talk a little bit about Launch Me. That has been a success. Everybody loves it. Kids love it. Families love it. Adults well, you get to meet it. Chewbacca. Of course. And Kylo Ren. Yes. Uh, okay, so are we going to add anything to that? We are. And we've already added it, actually. If you go to Launch Bay right now, you can see authentic replicas from Rogue One, A Star Wars Story. Things like Krennic's uh, shuttle, shore trooper blasters. You also can go behind the scenes and see how the film was made, which is always fun. Now, let's talk about Star Tours, The Adventure Continues. Now, I like it, I love, you guys love the new destinations, right? But I'm a little old school. I miss when it was random. I didn't know where I was gonna go in the galaxy. I'm like, whoa, I'm on Tatooine. I didn't know where I was going. I walked off like, oh man, that was awesome. Well, how many of you guys have been to Jakku? On Star Tours. No, okay. Okay. Remember when you could go and you never knew where you were going? Right. Did you like that? I did. Well, starting very soon, we're bringing that back. So Woo! you will never know. You will never know where in the galaxy far, far away you will end up. Mm -hmm. Oh. And as a surprise that we can announce. Ooh, a surprise we can announce. A surprise we, we can announce. In 2017, there will be a new destination from a film called Episode 8. Ooh. And what is that destination? Planet I can't tell you. Okay. Michael, no one's listening. Just tell me. You said that we're on, on live. Watch. That's right. Yeah. Okay. So it's I the planet I cannot tell you. Okay, okay. I just tried to get something for the diehard fans out there, Michael. Well, I'm a diehard fan. All right. And if you guys love all the uh, opportunities at Disney's Hollywood Studios, we also have something coming up very soon, which is a Star Wars guided tour. Now, this is a seven-hour tour with an all-in-the-nose Star Wars guide. It'll be, uh, you'll be able to ride Star Tours. You'll have dinner at a quick service restaurant with Star Wars inspired menu. It also includes the Star Wars Galactic Spectacular Dessert Party. It's something you do not want to miss. And speaking of. Yeah, 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 let's talk about nighttime. Star Wars A Galactic Spectacular. Have you guys seen that show yet? So as you know right now, we are celebrating the holidays at Disney's Hollywood Studios with Jingle Bam. Jingle Bell? Jingle Bell. Jingle Bam. Bam. Jingle Bam. Yeah. Jingle Bell. Jingle Bam! That's how you have to say it, Michael. Jingle Bell, Jingle Bam! Legally, I have to say it that way. <laughs> Try it. Come on, let it let it go. Come jingle, on. Jingle Bell, Jingle. Bam. Bam! There you go. Okay. Well, you, we've got that holiday offering right now, which is spectacular. But again, celebrating Rogue One, a Star Wars story, starting December 16th. Are you guys ready for this? Uh -huh. From December 16th through December 31st at Disney's Hollywood Studios. You can go and see Jingle Bell, Jingle Bam, Bam! and Star Wars A Galactic Spectacular. Wow! Two spectaculars in one night. In one theme park. In one theme park. Wow. One amazing destination. Wow, that is a lot of information. And we look forward to everything that's coming up. Well, thank you very much once again, Michael Roddy. Thank you, guys. May the force be with you. Always. Thank you very much, Michael Roddy. All right, so... They told me we're going to be moving on to do some trivia right now. All right, we got some Star Wars fans, you know, some trivia right now. So, here we go. Um, on what planet, you know what? <laughs> trivia stuff. And you tell me to stretch a little bit. Wouldn't it be cool if I brought somebody actually on stage that starred in Star Wars, one of the Star Wars movies? Wouldn't that be awesome? Would you guys go crazy? Huh? It's not going to happen. But I just wanted to check. So maybe for the next time, we can get somebody... All right, so let's get to that trivia question, all right? Ladies and gentlemen, straight from Rogue One, a Star Wars story, he plays Galen Erso. Welcome to the stage, actor Mads Mikkelsen! Wow! Thanks, thanks. Come on, guys. 
is here. <laughs> Orlando. Man, yeah. They didn't know you were here. Star Wars fans in yeah. Orlando. They are here, man. Hey, welcome and congratulations on the imminent release of your new film. Thanks. Now, are you excited to be here? I am. I'm over the moon. This is fantastic. That's no like, moon. <laughs> okay, all right. I'll leave it. Up. You know. <laughs> I'm under the moon. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Yeah. It's fantastic. It's fantastic to be here. It's fantastic to be part of the film. It's surreal. Mm -hmm. I don't know why they called me, but I, I like that they did it. All right. I like it. <laughs> you get to come to Florida. And uh, so let's talk about this. Uh, uh, you play Galen Urso. Yeah. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about the character without giving anything away? Yeah. What can you tell yeah, us? Yeah, I can. I can. Mm -hmm. I mean, he is. Um, He's a scientist. He's working on something that potentially has the ability to make the world a better place. Mm. But unfortunately, he also has the, the ability of making the world a much worse place. Mm. And he's also the father of Gina, so our hero in the film. Mm -hmm. That's all I can say. That's Thank all you can say. All right, now come back, come back. I won't ask any more questions. I won't ask any more hard questions. All right. I love your Stormtrooper shirt. You guys see this on the back? What is, that is an awesome shirt. All right, so we're all Star Wars fans. People watching are Star Wars fans. Do you consider yourself a Star Wars fan, Matt? Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I've, when I got the call, it was one of those strange calls. Like, okay, this is Gareth Edwards. I want to talk to you about the, the, you know, being in the next Star Wars film. And then your mouth just goes for a long time. And he talked yeah. for half an hour. I didn't hear anything. <laughs> <laughs> and then eventually he said to you, would you consider being it? Yeah. <laughs> So uh, and, and so that's how much of a fan I am, uh, like everybody else. Yeah. And uh, what, what was the, okay, so now you're on set. What was the coolest thing you saw? Well, you might, you might have, maybe I shouldn't ask you this, but uh, did you see something on set that you were just like, oh my goodness. I mean, everything, yeah. everything on that set. Uh -huh. it, was, it was crazy. It was, uh, I mean, obviously you got to take your fanboy hat off when right. you do it. It's serious. But sometimes when you step back and you drink a cup of coffee, you realize there's like 50 Stormtrooper helmets on a table. Uh -huh. And it's like, oh yeah, I'm in a Star Wars film. <laughs> yeah. And, but uh, I mean, you, you, you gotta focus, but it's very hard on those kind of circumstances. Uh -huh. I could imagine if I had to do a monologue with Chewbacca, I'd be like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. all right. So, you know what? I can say with everybody else, we're very excited about the film and we can't wait to see it. So, again, congratulations. Thanks a lot. Yes. Yep. You got that look in your eye. Yeah, you I got, got something look. else. What, 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 what now? I brought something. What, 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 what? I brought something. He br you brought something. Would you guys want to see a little extra clip from the Rogue One? Wait, 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 wait a second. Are you talking about something that no one has seen? Yeah, I haven't seen it actually. <laughs> oh, oh my so goodness. Be, yeah, just yeah. a little thingy. It's a little thing. Rogue One. And this this is kind of is going to give a little backstory between you and Krennic, right? That's exactly what it is. All right. Well, you know what, Matt, Krennic, I'm I'm going to let you roll it. All right. You, okay. You, you, well, you I, I I can't really add anything, but I mean, this is a scene between my character and the man with the cape. Take it. What is it you want? The work is stalled. I need you to come back. I won't do it, Krennic. We were on the verge of greatness. We were this close to providing peace and security for the galaxy. You're confusing peace with terror. Well, we have to start somewhere. We have a mission for you. shaking around over there look at that look at that bb8 pillow man oh you guys excited yeah. Woo! guys i cannot wait let me tell you something the force is strong is it not yeah. rebels make some noise yeah. i tell you man i feel right now like i can take on the empire all by myself yeah. that doesn't sound good maybe i shouldn't have said that okay I am 
here, representing the Advanced Weapons Research Division, leading the way in securing the galaxy against the growing threat of the Empire. To secure our tightening grip on the galaxy, we have a new elite force against the Rebellion. These are the Advanced Weapons Research Troopers! of these so-called rebels, we have a formidable new weapon to help quell this insurgency. But it is not our only line of defense. On the orders of Lord Vader, you are the first selected to witness the power of our latest innovation. The power cannot be measured. It is immeasurable. Now we reveal our new armed and fully operational battle station, the Death Star! Commander, we have several small ships approaching. Excellent! Our first test. You may fire when ready. Commence primary ignition. again, so let's stand here for a photo moment. Well, once again, we'd like to thank everybody for joining us. Thank you for watching wherever you are in the world. Thank you very much once again. Good night, and may the Force be with you, and we'll see you in a galaxy far, far away. This video is brought to you by Design by Alley. For all your graphics, web design, and photography needs, go to designbyalley.com.